Yes, she does. Oh. So she's wanting to go to the beach in Cebu. Oh, yeah. That's a little bit further than PCB. <laughs> we were getting ready to go when they locked down the uh, airports. Oh, yeah. Just, over, just about a year ago, we had planned on being there. Hmm. Hey, Miss Katie. Well, what happened to yes, your Eddie? internet? Internet. I don't know. It paused for a second. You paused on me too. We must have had a, a loose connection somewhere. What? What? I know. All right, girl. Well, I am going to go ahead and go back in here and get my friends up on the stage going with their um, program. But important dates for next week are Monday. You'll come. You'll turn everything in. Your charger. I'm gonna send out a. a and now a message that says everything that I want you to bring back. And if there's something that you've lost, like some cubes or some bears, don't worry about that. If you have them, great, bring them back. And if you don't, don't, don't fret about it. Um, but Monday we'll be back. And then on we Friday, the we last day of we it. Yeah. get with you guys, and I'm going to come by. Oh, and I yeah, I will return a, that all. Uh, listen. 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 Listen, on Friday, is our very, next Friday is our very, very last day of school. So I have some treats I'm going to bring you and this really fun confetti cannon that we're going to use to celebrate you completing kindergarten, okay? okay. Does that sound good? Yes. So I'm going to see you on Monday and I'm going to see you on Friday. Okay. Um, one more thing, right. Miss okay. Katie. Uh-huh. Don't forget, don't miss out this census, I will tell you. Okay. And you need... <laughs> You have to give me one, two to one toy for each for me, okay? Don't miss out my sentence what I'm gonna say, okay? Okay, okay. Oh, what, uh, Miss Katie? What uh -huh. happened to this? I don't remember. She do not know this. that. <laughs> it's a towel. I don't know what happened to it. It's a towel. It's supposed to be a towel, but someone ripped it apart. If yeah, with my somewhere. old towels, I do that. I rip them apart so that way I can use them as dust rags. What? Yeah, if I've got old towels that have got fringes on them, I'll cut them into little pieces so that way I can use them when I dust. Uh-huh. Maybe we could keep it for bunnies. A bunny. Oh, a shirt. Charlie. Get bunny in the clothes. Make bunny a shirt. You could. Charlie. We, you could. Um, we talked about right, going to the nature mom. station next week. Okay, okay, Miss Kitty, in one more uh -huh. Don't yeah, miss out. Here. We if, talked about our field trip next week to the nature uh -huh. station. Oh, perfect. That's great. The nature station is so much fun. You will love it. Hey, and you know, Dad knows Hematite Lake's right next door to the nature station, so... Maybe you can drive through there, too, and remember what that looks like. So that would be fun. The nature station is perfect, though. I love it. And you will have to tell me all about it on Friday whenever I come to your house and we have our um, little front yard celebration, okay? Hey, Does that sound good? Uh-huh. Okay. One more thing. Another interesting point about the, you know, I told you about that pile of uh, crushed slag uh -huh. that the uh, Trigg County used to use if you go uh -huh. down off that slag towards the little creek behind it uh -huh. uh, you sometimes can find pieces of iron that came out of the furnace that was thrown out by the with the slag huh neat that's cool my boys will be told they will be enthralled with that they will love that and if you ever get to go down to wrangler's camp over mm -hmm. at laura furnace I have found bigger chunks of iron over at Laura Furnace down at the Wrangler mm -hmm. Station camp on the uh, riding trails. And go up uh, to the top of the hill behind the furnace, you can find the old uh, pits where they dug the iron ore out. Uh. And down below the furnace towards the lake is the limestone quarry where they got the uh, oh, limestone mixed in with... Yes, you know, yeah, material. yeah. I know where you're talking about there, the limestone quarry. Mm -hmm. huh. uh, no, this is the one that goes to Laura Furnace. The entire quarry is about the size of this room. 
Oh, wow. Because it was 1850s furnace. Huh. It was one of the oldest furnaces over there. Oh, so yeah. everything they did was smaller because it was all hands-on work. Uh-huh. Hmm. Interesting. That's awesome. I would love, I want to know so much more about all of that. That would, that's so neat. Well, hmm. I did a paper on LBL for a 500 level history class. Oh, okay. Yeah. Then you do, you know, your research on it. I was working on a minor in history. Uh-huh. And uh -huh. unfortunately that class is the one I didn't get completed. Oh man. <laughs> hey, well, at least you still got something out of it because you've taught me something new today. So. Thank you. Hey, Miss Katie, one more thing. You have many more, yes, one more thing. <laughs> one more, one more thing, okay. Uh, go ahead, baby. So, well, I really wanted to tell you something important. Okay, tell me something important and then, I, then we'll I have go, okay? good news. I have good news. Okay, tell me your good news. Good news is, hmm, what do you think about it? Oh my goodness. Oh, I know. <laughs> the good news is, uh, at least you got your glasses. A long time you didn't have your glasses. I know. I'm so thankful that I've got them because when I look at the computer screen, it helps me. It's not all blurry and it's not all. It doesn't give me a headache. Okay, and that's enough for today. That's Bye. enough. Okay, baby. I love you, and I'll see you on Monday morning. Bye. Honey. Bye. Bye. Have a great weekend. Bye. Bye. See ya.